Today on the net, the blogosphere condemns the sentencing of Burmese opposition leader Aung San Suu Kyi. The Perseid meteor shower arouses interest among astronomy-loving net users. And the video of a young Rubik's Cube and video game champion. On Tuesday, the Burmese opposition leader, Aung San Suu Kyi, on trial for violating the terms of her house arrest, was sentenced to a further 18 months house arrest aimed at preventing her from running for the 2010 legislative elections. The Web reacts. As a verdict was announced, reactions flooded into Twitter. Messages denounced a farcical trial and called on net users to continue rallying for the release of Aung San Suu Kyi. A call also made on share sites, such as YouTube, where many videos like this extract of a film pay tribute to the Lady of Rangoon and to her struggle for greater freedom in the country. And the Nobel Peace Prize winner also enjoys heavyweight support from around the world, as shown by this video available online. The band U2 recently organized a march in her honor at a concert in Dublin. I'm on this site, created to mark her 64th birthday, Many political figures, including other Nobel Peace Prize winners, sent a message of support to Aung San Suu Kyi. Meanwhile, this NGO invites net users to sign this online petition to urge the UN to put pressure on the regime and obtain the release of the famous opposition leader. This portal also collects online donations to assist the many dissidents currently held in Burmese prisons. Tonight, many eyes will be pointing towards the stars. Like each year between mid-July and mid-August, a meteor shower known as Perseid will illuminate the summer night skies. This video, posted online by NASA, explains that this phenomenon is observed in the northern hemisphere when the Earth crosses a dust cloud ejected by the comet Swift-Tuttle. And this meteor storm is currently in its highest stage of visibility causing a stir amongst many stargazing net users. This man, for example, created this animation in order to explain that to benefit from the show, you should look towards the Perseus constellation, to which these meteors owe their name. He also points out that the light from the moon, which is entering its waning crescent phase, could prove to be problematic. Something that is not putting off comet hunters who are ready for action. They regularly post their images online, Photos which are then sent to specialized sites and forums. And whether it is on Twitter or on the portal of the International Meteorite Organization, professional and amateur astronomers are requested to share their observations and pool data they have gathered. Finally, this blogger offers some advice to nocturnal spectators. He recommends a laying down position for a better vision field and especially to avoid a stiff neck which could ruin your evening. Travel the world thanks to sound. This is the offer made by the site Sound Transit, which invites net users to discover countries and cities via different sounds taken from daily life. The sounds can be searched for by keywords or by place names. You can therefore listen to Colombians celebrating a birthday or discover what a Vietnamese market sounds like. Recordings which can be downloaded, shared and reused free of charge. The Facebook network recently teamed up with researchers at Berkeley University to create a new application. It will allow net users to share a portion of their processor's idle computer power to increase researchers' calculation potential. For the moment, users can contribute to three projects, including climate change forecasting. <laughs> This American teenager is a YouTube star of the moment. In this video, which is currently circulating online, we see him playing with dexterity with a famous Guitar Hero game, while simultaneously solving a Rubik's Cube with one hand, an exploit worthy of the admiration of many net users.